Okay, Christmas just came early. Um, you know, I messed up my router a while back, putting in that IVAC switch, completely my fault. Um, but uh, I'm telling you right now, I can't even believe this. I got this on eBay and, you know, these have become um, hard to find, you know, with COVID and all this stuff. Uh, routers are becoming more and more expensive, the good ones. And sometimes you'll see this for like 500 and something. Sometimes it'll be, you know, 400. Sometimes, you know, normally it's like 369, typically 389. I got this thing for some weird, you know, I don't even know what happened, but I got it for, um, I think it was uh, 369. But check this out with a $50 discount for what? I don't know, 50 bucks off. So it was uh, what, three, what is that? 319, I think 319 plus tax, free shipping. And the thing came in like three days or two days. Um, but check this out, I got this delivered. They didn't even, um, you know, notify me that it was delivered. It was sitting out on the, the, by the front door without any box. This is how it was sitting out there, completely visible in the middle of the porch. I cannot believe this in broad daylight. And they believe this like this. I can't believe the, the um, sender didn't put it in a box to cover this up. I am just shocked, but either way, whatever. <laughs> Luckily I was here because if I wasn't here, who knows what would have happened. Um, 369 minus 50 bucks. I, I'm just like dying right now. I just sold two of my um, Porter Cable, the 7518s. I put them on eBay and sold them. Sold one for, um, with shipping. They were, um, total price with shipping was uh, 700 and, was it like 30? The price of the shipping was 80. Um, so the router itself was like 650 or something like that um, for one of the routers. The other router, um, and that was the one with the base and everything. The other one was in the lift. That guy sold for uh, 500 plus 80 for shipping. So 580 for that guy. So uh, those two routers that I just sold, Porter Cable 7518s, if you guys understand routers in you know shops you understand those routers are really good but um i don't like them okay i like the milwaukee the milwaukee to me is way better um i don't care if you're in a lift or not this is a better motor and i tell you um i cannot believe since porter cable doesn't make those anymore people are like clamoring to these things um, but trust me when i say if you can go right now on ebay and see if you can grab this thing this is an incredible price. Um, so let me let's just check it out and see what's what, because I still can't believe I just got this for 50 bucks off. Yeah, just making sure everything's good. Um, wrenches are good. Um, and what's also interesting is that I actually, although I broke mine, uh, I clipped the cord with the, um, you know, connecting that IVAC thing, and I was just gonna do like a sample plug-in for something. Oh, check out the video, it's on it. Um, absolutely incredible. But look at this thing, man. Are you kidding me? I cannot believe that I just got this for 50 bucks off. I'm just dumbfounded right now. So, <laughs> wow. Um, okay, I, almost, I, I think I'm gonna go buy another one, actually, now that I think about it. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm going to go grab another one because that deal never comes around. Oh my gosh. That is crazy. Yeah, I'm actually going to stop this video. I'm going to go grab another one and before these things are out. But um, yeah, got everything. Um, and so the other, the routers I have, the other one I keep in there. Um, that's the one I hurt. But the other one I use day in and day out and I've been using it for um, probably 16 years. Um, that thing is just goes, man. It doesn't stop. So I'm, I'm thinking at some point I've switched out the brushes. I've, you know, 
I'm probably sure that I'm gonna have to do some repair on it. So this is why I like to have backups just in case. And even though it's in my secondary router table, I consider it a backup because if it does break, I can grab this one and put it in there. Um, Cause if I'm out, if I'm without my router and my router table, the big router bench, that's really a problem. Um, I just, you know, day in and day out, I'm using my tools. So I can't possibly be without it. So I don't want to be using, I mean, I have other ones I could throw in there, but I don't really want to. Um, and it's going to affect my production. So got to always be thinking that way. But I, I went to fix the other one. I went to go to um, grab a um, part. And I think maybe it's, it's something that I could uh, fix, but uh, the part used to be available and now it says it's not available anymore. It's been discontinued. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? And it's like an $80 part, so it's not cheap. But um, so I think what I'm gonna do is grab another one of these routers and then that way I have just a couple of them because you know, since I sold those other ones, I might as well grab these. So, um, but yeah, pretty sweet.